Hey everyone, welcome back to JavaScript Advanced Tutorial. In this tutorial, we will understand what is a DOM. We now move to the JavaScript as used within a web browser, commonly called client-side scripting. Whatever we had learned so far is legal JavaScript code. From now, the future few tutorials will depend on the DOM scripting. Hoping that you know the basic of HTML and CSS, so we will move forward with the DOM scripting. Using HTML and CSS, you can create a static informative web pages and these pages can be called document. Using JavaScript, you can fairly make these pages dynamic. Using the web browser rather than working on the text, you can use graphical interface. These pages might dynamically load information as needed. So we will first understand what is DOM. DOM stands for document object model. According to the document object model, all tags in HTML is an object. The text specified in the tag is also an object. So all these objects are accessible using JavaScript. Conceptually, DOM is a tree. A tree consists of nodes. Every node has parents or zero or more child nodes. The root node is document, has only one child HTML. The HTML element has two children's title and head. The following is the DOM tree. You can also call HTML as a root element. In this DOM tree, we had two child nodes, head and body. Using the root element, you can access all the child nodes. In the head node, we have title and in the body, we have HTML elements. It depends on you what you put inside the body and in the head. If you put anything in the body, then the browser will create a child node of body element and you can access this node using the DOM tree. To understand DOM tree in detail, we need to learn from the example. So we will just create a simple example here. So I will just create a simple HTML snippet. So I will just specify an exclamation mark here and just enter. So this is our simple HTML document. I will just remove unwanted tag from the HTML document. We have doc type, HTML, head, title, body and in the body we have paragraph with demo text right so this is your simple html snippet so in this example we have a root element html and the root element consists of two child nodes head and the body in the head we had title with the title text and in the body we had paragraph with demo text you can access all the text and all the html tags using the dom tree to understand how DOM tree look like, just run your document and right click on the document and say inspect. So here on the elements tab, you can see your DOM tree. So in this DOM tree, we have a root element HTML. By clicking on the tags, you can explore your DOM tree like this. You can extend your DOM tree by adding multiple tags in the body or in the head of the HTML document. In the next tutorial, we will understand how to access this DOM tree in the JavaScript. In the next tutorial, we will understand what is the use of DOM object and what can you do with this object. That's it. That is all for this tutorial. I hope you understand this lecture. I have asked a question in the comment. Answering that question will definitely help you to improve your knowledge. That is all for now. We will see you in the next tutorial.